Welcome, oily community. This is Tara Wagner, your fairy oil parent, and I have a science experiment for you today. I'm going to show you what happens when you use certain essential oils on synthetics that are made from petrochemicals. So you're going to see in front of me this array of oils. So I've got lemon, lime, grapefruit, wild orange, and peppermint. Smells amazing, by the way. And what I'm going to do is put a drop of each onto the styrofoam so that you can see what happens. Um, essential oils, certain essential oils, specifically citruses, are natural solvents, which means that they break down petrochemicals. And so when you are using essential oils, this is a really great way to clean. You can get um, maybe sticker residue or dry erase or marker or anything like that gum off of surfaces. This is our peppermint. I'm doing it with peppermint as well so you can see what happens with one that doesn't have those same compounds. Um, makes it really great for cleaning. Also really great to detoxify your system from petrochemicals. Like Getting that out of your system is going to be really helpful. Um, but when you're using oils and let's say you're putting them in a glass of water, you're not going to want to put it in a styrofoam cup. You're not going to want to put it in a plastic cup because it breaks down those petrochemicals. So let me show you what's happening here. Can you guys see that? As it's slowly breaking down those petrochemicals, this would be what would end up in your body and you don't want that, right? Um, you also wanna be careful because if you have these on your hands and then you go to touch something, like maybe you're typing on the computer, it can start to wear away at the letters on your computer. If you spill it onto something plastic, it can ruin the finish of that plastic. So you wanna be careful with those things. Um, I really encourage you to do this experiment at home. And if you do it on a piece of styrofoam and nothing happens, that either means that that oil is not one that is gonna break down those petrochemicals, or it means that your styrofoam is actually corn-based, corn-derived. And these will not do the same thing to natural compounds as it will petrochemicals. I can put this into my hand and nothing is gonna happen. Um, the most that you might see is a drying effect and which makes it really good for oily skin and it's also why you might want to dilute so that you've got that moisturizing effect. Um, but this is just a really awesome experiment to show you the power of oils, the way that they don't work the same on different types of compounds. These aren't like synthetic solvents, these are natural solvents. They're going to work on petrochemicals and not work the same way on your body. So I hope that this was fun. I hope that this showed you a little bit, and I hope that you always remember to put your oils into glass, into stainless steel, maybe into ceramic, but never into plastic or into um, styrofoam if you're going to be drinking out of it. Now, the question that I always get is, well, what about my diffuser? Well, number one, you're not drinking out of your diffuser. Number two, the plastic in your diffuser is tougher. It's going to last a lot longer. It may break down over many years, but because you're not going to consume that water that's in there, you're good to go. I hope this was helpful. Have fun.